Hey you guys and welcome back to my channel. You already know you rocking with the messy YouTuber baby. So um I want to thank y'all for rocking with me and make sure y'all go ahead and click that subscribe button, okay? Because you're here and you about to get the real real mess, okay? Because y'all may know or may not know if you listen to my videos, but I'm definitely from New Orleans or whatever, and I do live uh I'm not gonna say where I live in New Orleans, but uh I don't live I'm not even gonna say that. So anyway. So, if y'all heard or not, Beyonce's house burned down, y'all. And um, that was just so weird to me that that happened. For some reason, my first thought is that little... Because a lot of people say, like, it's voodoo. And I think it's voodoo, too. Um, even though that they're reporting some arson. Somebody reportedly went into the kitchen and it exploded or some shit like that. I don't know. In the garden district. The beehive is going to be upset about this, I am. It was a former church that is... Garden District. The Beehive is going to be upset about this, I am. It was a former church that is now owned by Beyonce and Jay-Z. That's according to neighbors who live near the 1500 block of Harmony Street, right off St. Charles. Uh, we couldn't tell how badly the home was damaged, so that we can report to report back to Queen Bee, but it looks like it was already in need of repairs. But the neighbors say no one lives there right now, and they think someone broke into the home, and at some point this evening, started a fire in the kitchen. Luckily, it wasn't burned down. But what I'm really thinking is that if it was the voodoo situation, do you think it was because that video had went viral of her, you know, exposing that little demonic face? And maybe since so many people were scared that that could have happened because that house is in the 1500 block of Harmony Street, 5 plus 1 is 6. It happened at 615, 1 plus 5 is 6. That's 66. That's another 6 if you ask me. 666, okay? I don't know what was going on, but um, I'm pretty sure it is attributed to witchcraft. So uh, maybe Beyonce scared some of y'all straight, you know what I'm saying? And um, y'all just want to rock with Queen Bee because that house sure did go into a small fire. Now, I, I heard a report that the fire was getting big and that they stopped at the right time because it could have been more damaged. But some reports just say it was a little one alarm fire. And I just want to say something funny that happened between me and my niece. And I told her I was just, just the other day, if it wasn't yesterday, like the day before yesterday, like the 20th, something like that. I was like, um, yeah, Beyonce brought a house down here and Beyonce shouldn't live in that house because that is a sacred place. Okay. That's a sacred place where worship used to take place. That was a prosper. Presbyterian church, some crap like that. So, how is somebody gonna live there, take showers there, and all that? It's just, and then be so sinful there. It, it's just ridiculous. So, I'm very surprised about this fire. And guess what? I say, huh, one for the Lord, one for the army of the angels. Okay. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Holla. Okay, so I had to record this again, but when I was outside making fun of the devil beating his wife, because I can't explain that right now. I might write it in it. But um, this is the bread that I received. The bread and the blood of Christ when I was outside talking about Beyonce.